and week. welcome back to Broke Till Friday podcast. We've got special guest Zordon. Uh, Walter's back. <coughs> He's in Tacoma, Washington. His current address is 3269. Uh, coordinates <laughs> negative 38. <No. laughs> Just give some coordinates to like a, a random dead body in the Bahamas. <laughs> um, remember, guys, if you're on YouTube, like, comment, subscribe. If you're on Spotify, uh, remember to rate us. And you, we we can be found. You can be found wherever podcasts are. <laughs> we can be found wherever podcasts are available. This week's episode, let's let's go through our chapters. Chapter one is going to be... The fuck? Where's the chapter? <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Um, so we have creepy pastas today, but first we have... Festivus for the rest of us, the airing of grievances, as we all know. I, I, I lack a metal pole, unfortunately, for us to, to swing around. Um, as as we all know, is the is the Festivus tra- uh, Thanksgiving tradition. I have no you idea what the fuck you're it. talking you don't about. Swing right on now. It. You don't do nothing to it. You just set it up, and that's it. All right, good. Uh, now Michael was going to tell me something about some experience he had. What? What were you going to remember? Tell you us? were going to tell us you were setting up a story, and then you never set up the story. Yeah. So, yeah. He's baked out of his mind. Sorry, folks. We'll try again Damn. next week. No, what the fuck was this? Damn. <laughs> Not you story. tell me. Like, no, no, he did tell us. Dude. It was about like when he was working, he, he would follow. Oh, yeah. Like, uh, dude, it wasn't even that big of a fucking story. Dude. Tell me the whole story. Start from the beginning. But improvise. Fuck. Yeah. Do something. Oh, impro- okay. do something. <laughs> <laughs> improvise you your life. He's going to hit through the screen, dude. Um. Fuck. What was I thinking? Dude? All right. You were at work. <laughs> okay, so I used to work at this uh, waffle factory right here in Vernon. Yeah. And I was pretty good at the job. Like it was super easy. Like time went by really quickly because I was just doing the same consecutive thing over and over again. Just like get waffle, put it in a box, put it in a pile. Get waffle, put it in a box, put it in a pile, and it's just over and over again. And then into a, a pallet. That pallet got taken away over and over again. And then I did it so well that to the point where like okay, we no longer need like a certain amount of people doing this job because it was like certain areas of other people doing the same job as you me. You were so good you lost people their jobs? Damn. No, it's like they like they lessened the, the group of people because they saw me they, and other people. It's like, oh, they can do You guys do are doing much. so good. We got to fire the other ones. No, they, mm-hmm. we just got moved to another part. Um, I got moved into another uh, another part which was the freezer, the colder section and mm-hmm. you had to wear like heavy jackets because yeah. it was like frosty. Everything was frosty. Did the same thing but now with frozen like the the boxes already come like made and i had to put those in another pallet yeah and i did the same thing and i got and i did it really fast but like they were one of those jobs like you can't just sit around and do nothing you have to always do something if you have time to lean you got time to clean but like there's nothing to do and it's like they like sweep but like there's nothing it's just frost on the floor it's clean it's just nothing yeah so So i would would sit down in the chair i would sit down in the chair like this and just fall asleep (laughs) And wait for the fucking things to come in. And I would do that for a while until I got caught. And this guy is just like, he just wanted to <laughs> snitch. He just had it out. Had it out for me, dude. But it was a good job. Well, you took, every, you uh, took everybody's job, dude. Yeah. <laughs> fucking uh, not too long, af- not too long after that, that right. waffle uh, um, company went out of business. Uh, see, uh, it was because they fired Michael. Yeah. Michael was the straw holding everything together. You're drinking my Gatorade. He was a little pin. You're right, I did. Oops. Communism. Motherfucker. I call him the twig boy. <laughs> yeah. So that was um, that was Michael's experience at the waffle factory. Did you guys have them in all colors? You know, red, <laughs> green, blue. Yes. Purple. Purple. Uh, red. Oh, you actually uh, did have purple what was, the, what was the point of that story? I don't know, dude. Well, the point was that it's uh, it was a place, dude, that I did. <laughs> <laughs> All right, everyone. Next week, this week we worked on nouns. Next week we'll work on verbs. <laughs> We've got a place. We need people, and we need a thing. Go, Edward. Tell us your people story. Oh yeah, My tell people story. T- 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 tell tell a uh, funny story, dude. Tell funny us your people story. story. Fuck, what was, what was your people story. story when you went or up a north? Funny, a place. No, when you went up no, north. No, 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 no. A place that you can sleep. Re- that you have slept on, like, like a bizarre place, or maybe a place that's like the weirdest place you weirdest place you fell in the sleep. I yeah. I I. Or jacked off. Or jacked, jacked off. off. Oh, jacked I, I jacked off. off in Seattle. No. <laughs> uh, so I was in mid space. No. Uh, see, the thing is, I don't really sleep in weird places, to be honest. You've never slept in a weird place. You could have ended that sentence with, I don't really sleep. <laughs> I don't really sleep. You know? That would have no, been good. <laughs> uh, Walter, are you just doing like tabs of Molly as we're waiting yeah, here? Yeah, fucking. What are you doing? Oh, y'all, y'all, story, y'all stories are so boring. I got to take Molly to fucking. Tahin. Uh, oh, cocaine. Tahin Sorry. He's mainlining tahin <laughs> yeah. out the bottle. Bro, just you can shake it into your mouth. You know that, right? 
I don't want to do that. <laughs> Shake it to his dirty ass hands. What the fuck? Get some mango it's or something. Some shit. Yeah. He doesn't have like an apple or something around to eat <laughs> it with. I'm, I'm poor, an orange, I'm uh, sorry, I'm poor. fucking carrot. I, pl- so I, I qualify for food stamps. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> use those food stamps. Use that EBT to get some mangoes. Yeah. Fresh fruit. It counts. I'm thinking about it. I'm thinking about it. <laughs> you've, you've woken up somewhere funny at a bank. Uh, woken up somewhere funny? Yeah. I've passed out somewhere funny. That That's counts. Different. That counts. <laughs> that that counts. counts. You sleep. Sleep. If you pass out, you got to wake up. You know? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. True. <laughs> no, I, yeah. I, I I basically fall asleep like anywhere during transportation. That makes like, sense. I fall asleep like, for my entire like high school like career or whatever the fuck. Like when you're on the Appalachian Trail, you just fall asleep? Yeah, you know. <laughs> Wait for someone just coming. Wait, going. so you've no. been on like a bus and you've been falling uh, and you just fall asleep? You're I fall asleep people. on uh, dude, basically every bus I've ever been on. How do you? Aren't you worried about like falling asleep and, no, no, and like, going past your stop, dude? No, usually. Okay, that did happen a couple of times, but more often that was only when I was really exhausted. More often than not, you, I just wake up whenever I get to my stop. Like I'll, I'll be arriving at my stop and I'll just. Same thing awake. happened to me, but Fuck for no, different yeah. reasons. So I would go on the bus, right? And then like my IBS would kick in and I'd be like, oh my God, I gotta go to the bathroom, but I can't get off. And I'm like, okay, I'm gonna trick myself. And I would like force myself to fall asleep on the bus. And then I like wake up every so often and fall asleep, wake up and fall asleep. And then I I woke up like next to my, like basically right next to my stop. And I was like, oh, awesome. And then my stomach starts doing the, and I'm like, okay, I'm almost here. I'm almost here. And I would walk into the AM, PM and be like, bathroom. And they'd be like, key. Key. And then just take a dump over there real quick. You fall asleep thinking you're using the restroom. Oh, no. And then you poop yourself. No, no, I don't nah. think I, I'd ever. Um, I don't think I've ever shit myself. You in my sleep. yourself. Yeah. Most recently, uh, okay. Most recently, I had diarrhea. <laughs> Most <laughs> recently, I shat I myself sleep. last week, dude, because the fucking Mucinex DM. Apparently, no. the side effect is it'll give you diarrhea, right? Because it Chorro. loosens up the mucus, oh, but it no. loosens up the mucus in your stomach lining and your bowel. And I hadn't eaten any food, right? Yeah. So like, I'm I'm here. It's like I, I took it in the morning, right, to stop the coughing and stuff. And then it's like twelve o'clock, and I'm like. Like, hmm. And I so I set up the fart, and then I I like it's it's like, and I'm like oh no I shit myself nope. and I nope. immediately go to the bathroom ah. and like it didn't get on my <laughs> underwear or anything luckily but I was like I know like I did I fucking shit myself like it was like, like Bobby just, Lee during almost, Hot Ones I just, ooh. straight up where he, when he's like adjusting it just he's like out. <laughs> it peeked out the corner yeah but Bobby Lee's was like a lot because you you it's audible on the fucking mic dude when he shits himself in Hot Ones he he's like oh wait give me a second and then his stomach's grumbling and then he goes. <laughs> And you can hear ah. it. And then even even the um, fucking Sean Evans goes, oh, no, is that what I think it is? And then he's like, oh, yeah, sorry. And then they cut. And then they, <laughs> they, they <come. laughs> um, I, I, I know a lot of Bobby Lee's that's shitting funny. himself yeah, stories. That's so They're, embarrassing. The one where he shit uh, himself on the 101. So he was driving yeah. with, with Kalila and then they're like, he, they're in the Prius and he's like, I- I'm not going to make it. And they're sitting in like standstill traffic and he's like, oh, I'm not going to make it. And she's like, babe, just, just like shit yourself or whatever. Right. Or like go uh, out the window or something. And then he pulls down his pants, shits into the passenger seat, into the passenger seat. And then they, they leave after uh, Well, they, I mean, they leave. They're still in the st- standstill traffic. And they, like, had to get it professionally cleaned and all this stuff. Oh. But I know this man pulled down his pants and shit into the seat on the That's 101. so gross. And so At least put your ass out the window or something. Dude, that story, when I was listening to it, it was giving me, like, secondhand shit. I was, like, starting to get sweaty. I was like, oh, God, now I got to take a shit, dude. Uh, <laughs> you, you, ever, you ever you ever shit and you get, like, a moco consistency? Yeah, yeah. That, that, that happened to me recently because I had, like, really bad IBS for, like, the last, like, month or so. And so I've been, like, shitting nonstop. <laughs> Like then, every like, three wipe, seconds, and then you're like, "Oh, it's funny. yeah, it's like a booger." Uh, and then you like put it in your mouth. Like, Come on. No, I've, I've had that intrusive <laughs> thought though when I'm picking up the dog, fo- the do- dog poop, and I'm like, "Oh, Snickers," you know. Oh uh, no, oh, I, I get the other one where like you just look at it and you want to like squish it with your hand. Just, I mean, you can squish it with your hand when you have it in the napkin or whatever. It's, that's not illegal as far as I'm no. concerned. Yeah, but no, I, I, I was this like. I think it was, was supposed music. to be about creepy pasta. Yeah. Like, what are we doing? <laughs> well, this is about shitty pastas. And someone's eating pasta at some point and shit themselves. So, you know. All right. Tell, I me, about count the, it. tell me about the creepy pastas you heard yesterday. Oh, so the creepy pastas. So I, I didn't watch both of them. I only watched the gas station one. And uh, how do you call it? I fell asleep two hours into it. So. <laughs> and you were just driving asleep. <laughs> you were driving. What's the weirdest yeah. place you fall <laughs> asleep? <laughs> at the wheel. Where were you Obviously. driving to? No, I was driving uh, San Francisco. from San Francisco. What the fuck? I was in San Francisco was less a than a long drive, less than, dude. <laughs> less than nine hours ago. Oh, no, you no, drive no, your Prius? Hours ago, no, it was like twelve hours no. ago, dude. Oh, twelve hours. You drove your Prius? No, I drove the, the Wait, van. What time do you get here? Cell. In the morning. 
in, in the morning, I got here about uh, either six or eight. I don't remember. Six or eight. Okay, no, that was probably like 16 hours ago that you were over there. Ah. Okay, 16 hours ago, I was over there. I just drove down. Why, left why San Francisco? Why not like Beverly Hills? Or not Beverly, but fucking Orange County or something. Beverly Hills, you Orange get shot County. in the back. Well, Orange County, uh, you get shot in the back. I Honestly, I don't what? know why. But it's, uh, it, it's because there's, there's a lot of money over there. Like, that's where we had, like, uh, our biggest sale. We had a... Um, yeah, but like you, you go to San Francisco, I think the guys are, that are on drugs, they're just hanging there. I think you hang his your question is, on them. I think his question is, why is the market for lamps so specifically in San Francisco? Because all the Mexicans down no, here it's just are a doing city. that. It's like another big city where mo- a lot of people don't really sell lamps, and there's a bunch of little cities like across there you can like set up at. Uh, and so it's like opening up a taco stand in like fucking you know Nebraska. Mm-hmm. No one's gonna do that. People do it here because it's like a bunch of Mexicans, right? You have like yeah. a taco stand everywhere. You do that in Nebraska, you freeze to death. Um, but also, you get the cops called on you because they'll be like, "Where's your food safety permits?" Yeah, I've seen that a couple times. Okay, yeah, no, but <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I don't know. That's what, that's where we had our biggest sale. We, we had like Walter, a weekend where like every day tooth? we were making. Nah, I did. I had big gaps. Oh, I oh, thought you lost. Yeah, a tooth. I thought you lost a tooth. Low Holy key? shit! Fuck! I don't know why right now. I just noticed that. I think it's because you're Zordon. Oh, you. Gingivitis. Okay, well, tell, tell us about the goddamn story. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I just, my, my, <laughs> dude, my ADHD is just going, and then you got to point out this, and you got to point out that. Go. No, uh, but yeah, that, that was with it. We, we made, like, uh, not this weekend, but, like, that's, up north is where we made our, like, biggest thing, where it was, like, for the three days that we went up there, we made, like, like 2,500 bucks a day for, like, working four hours. His money long. His pockets deep. So that's why I just, ball so just, hard they call me a fucking sell, nutsack. The end, the, end, the end result is that we sell more over there. That's why. Why? I don't fucking know. I'm clean with we it. We sell more. <laughs> now, wasn't Not this weekend. Story. Not He's this weekend. Really. You're listening to fucking creepy pasta. Yeah. So, so tell, oh, tell, I don't tell. know why. Why the fuck went on that tangent? Uh, well, because we asked where do you sell and why. Uh, to be fair, it's not a tangent. Continue. Either way, so I'll, I was like that. It was pretty fun. But you know what? The entire time I was thinking. Hmm. If this is like just like crackhead. Welcome to Night Vale. Mm. It, that's 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 literally what that podcast is. Mm. It's crackhead. <laughs> welcome to Night Vale. Because mm. it's instead of a radio, oh, yeah. instead of like a radio station, it's a f- gas station at the edge of town. Instead of uh, what is this, Gary, Indiana, <laughs> literally. So it, it's literally just crackhead. Uh, welcome to Night Vale. I've never heard of Welcome to Night Vale. It's a it's a podcast and it's very. It's basically that, except it's like more posh, I guess. Mm-hmm. Quick song to start with. Welcome, welcome to the jungle. Welcome to uh, George, George, Georgia. I don't know the devil. What? Georgia. What did oh, you that's just? Not it. That's what not are you it. saying? I said, dude? Quick songs that start with welcome, and then I said welcome to the jungle. <laughs> oh. I don't know. Go. Um, there's not a lot of songs that start with welcome. Welcome yeah. to the Black Parade. Next. Oh fuck. Man, you guys are terrible at this game. Hey, I don't, welcome you guys is, that welcome is such a specific fucking word, dudes. Welcome to? Yeah, that's... Mm, songs with bad. welcome in the title. Come on. Walter. Okay. A- Walter, any song Walter, with welcome? welcome? All right. Uh, welcome home. Look at that. See? Welcome home? That's, he just said two <laughs> words. <laughs> yeah. That's not even a fucking... Right? Right? He just said two fucking words. Welcome on <laughs> in. I don't know. <laughs> I just made this shit up. <laughs> welcome to Georgia. Welcome, <laughs> welcome the king. There, I said a fucking... Oh, that's, well, probably that's a Bible a, song. You're right. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I bet you there is a song called Welcome Home. Yeah. Welcome like, Home it, by Peter, yeah, like, Peters and Lee, 1973. <laughs> welcome Home, son. Welcome Home, Coheed and Cambria. See, that's look, the one look I was up, of. Look up, see if there's a song called Welcome To. Welcome the king, dude. That's the one I welcome, said. Okay, welcome the king. I so win. Got, w- welcome to my house. That's a good one. <laughs> Welcome yeah, to King is. Jesus <laughs> image, of course. Song by Destiny Worship Music. <laughs> of course. I said worship. About, I said worship. How about your, your welcome from Dwayne Johnson? Uh, what? Oh, you're welcome? Hey, that's the That's your welcome. Yeah. That, that's your welcome. That's oh, it is different. called your welcome. You're that's right. a different thing, though. You said welcome. Look, look up if there's any song called Welcome too. I don't think welcome so. Welcome T.O. Is welcome's on title? Is it? Welcome dance. Hello, hello. How are you? Preschool cafe. Nope. Ah, oh, that would have been perfect. Sorry, sir. Sorry, sir. <laughs> songs that start with and. Start. No, no. I said songs that have welcome in the title. Oh. Okay. No, you said start. start with welcome. Welcome. And, uh, you said start with welcome. Oh, uh, maybe I did. Oh, well, it's too late now. <laughs> too late. All right. Um, famous Walters. Go, Walter Cronkite. Walter White. Uh. 
<laughs> he lost the Walter, <laughs> I, uh, Wal- yeah. Walter Calderon. Walter Disney. <laughs> Walter Disney? Walter Disney? Yeah. Walt Disney. Walt Disney. Not, that's Walt, not Walter. N- motherfucker, I would know. <laughs> he's the he's part of the Walter know. Club. He knows all the Walters that have he ever walted. Every Walter, every Most Walter of them are Salvador. Walter, 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 Walter Elias Elias Disney. Oh fuck! What do you think Walt was short for? Waltonimus. <laughs> <Yeah>. Obviously. <laughs> Obviously. Walt <laughs> Waltamir. Waltenberg. Jesus. Waltam sire. Waltichael. <laughs> Waticle. Um. Okay. So. Cream pastas. What are some of the favorite cream pastas that you have, Michael? The ones you were going through. You told us you were going yeah. through a rabbit hole yesterday. No, I didn't go through a rabbit hole. Walter, Walter was going. It's Walter's hour. Walter's minute. Zordon, what you got? I've seen one of those. i seen the one of the gas station, but it was like the one where they got a new employee and then like the shit keeps like repeating. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah, that's the that's the one that, that he shared. That's the one I was listening. The one that's like crackhead. Uh, yeah, Welcome to Night Mail. For me, it wasn't like two hours. It was like a 10 minute story. What? I think mm. it can be one of yeah. them. Yeah. I mean, to be fair, I got an eight hour to be fair someone seven. probably just ripped it off and then condensed it to the 10 like scary minutes, you know? Because uh, there's always those stories that are like, I mean, Snow White and I, Seven Dwarves. Rap, whatever, you can do one of the stories minutes. I remember specifically is like, like there's a like skinwalker activity happening like in the middle of one of his shifts and he starts to like hallucinate and he thinks it's like part of his like illness <laughs> with not being able to go to sleep. But it, it's mm. like, it's, it's crazy. I don't remember much. I remember it's like vivid. Mm-hmm. I mean, it's, it's not vivid. It's blurry. It's because you're high, man. But yeah, no. Okay. I just been a while since it's been a while since I've read those stories. I don't like it when you it's get. Because you're high. a junkie, boy. <laughs> junkie. You're a weed junkie. You're addicted to the marriage you want to. Uh, no, I, I I I I like the I like the thing. It was it was a nice uh, take on that type of format. I I really like Welcome to Night Vale. So I really like the. Uh, the gas station one. It was really... It was kind of spooky. But... You know what's spooky? It did let me go to sleep. It was nice, like, background noise, too. Because yes. uh, at one point, I switched with uh, with my dad as a driver. For and an then hour. as he's driving, he knocks out. Yeah. Ah, just... uh, okay. yes. The number one creepypasta Slender of all time. Man. The Slender Man. The I can't take it seriously anymore. Yeah, after all me the neither. The Slender Man. There were some Moitas. Candle Cove. That's a classic. Robert the Doll. That's a fucking. That's not a creepypasta. That, a creepy that shit's po- basically yeah. real, dude. No, that's not. It's I, not real, dude. It's not fucking. Anytime real. people take pictures of him and stuff, this bad shit starts happening to them, and then they're they have to like write letters. Let's go I'm take sorry. a picture. I'll fucking take. A, I'll take a picture of me taking a dump on it. Like I don't know about that. Okay, wait, let me. Where see. is it at? Doll. It's gonna be like Illinois or some bullshit. Yeah. It, it's it's what the movie the fucking Annabelle movies are based on. No, Annabelle is based on a Raggedy Ann doll. That's a yes. different one. That's this, another doll. Yeah. And that shit moves. I've seen that shit fucking move in a sealed glass case. Uh, You cannot tell me that is not real. uh, You will not convince me. When the doll crawls Uh, up your ass and takes your soul, dude. I'll fucking take a shit. (laughs) I'll fucking loosen my soul. It's crawling up my ass. I'll push back. (laughs) Dude, I got a fucking nosebleed. You'll get get fucking. You'll get fucking. uh, What is it called? Um, Thanos assed. It is Robert no, the Doll. Prolapsed Robert anus, the dude. <laughs> You're going to get prolapsed no, anus. No, dude, dude, dude. I, I was trying to take a shit the other day, right? Uh, this was like yesterday before before we left. And like like it wouldn't come out. It wouldn't come out because I've had IBS and then all of a sudden I got like constipated. And so I was like, I was trying to push it out. I was trying to push it out. Right as I was pushing it out, pushed so hard, I got a nosebleed. I started dripping dude, blood all over the good, floor. that's not good, man. What the fuck? Oh, my God. I was like, that's, that's not the flex you think it is. you have to drink water. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly? Yeah. I, I drink, drink so much, dude. Water. No, you don't. I have don't. a fucking, like, There's dry. water and juice. Thing. He's like, orchata. That's orchata. water. Orchata. Yeah. They put water in yeah. this. Yeah. It's agua the curse fresca. of Robert the Doll <laughs> in 2009. Of, like, lemon juice, and then you get a cup of milk, and then you, like, no, no, no! It's yeah. it's you. <laughs> you take, you up take two shots of <laughs> olive oil to coat your stomach before you go out drinking. Some some guy's uncle told him that he's like, if you drink two shots of olive oil before you go out drinking, it'll help coat your stomach so you don't get wasted. So he took two shots of olive oil. He goes out and he took a shot of vodka, and then like ten minutes later, he shat himself because <laughs> the olive oil just makes you shit yourself. Yeah, the the like the uncle pranked him basically. <laughs> Ultimate prank. So, The Curse of Robert the Doll, May 6, 2009 by Barbara Weibel. I snapped a photo of Robert the Doll before reading that he puts curses on anyone who takes his photograph. Uh-oh. Surely it's just a myth, I thought. 
Curious, I began reading about the doll's history. In 1903, Robert was given to four-year-old Jean Otto, who lived in Key West, Florida. As Jean grew up, he blamed everything bad that happened on the doll. By the time Jean was married, Robert had taken the blame for a lifetime of lies, misdeeds, and mischief. Some say Robert's face had begun to change by the time Jean died in 1974, that his eyes grew more expressive. It was Chucky that I was thinking of. <laughs> Probably. Yeah. People insisted that the doll moved around and could be heard giggling behind their backs. Many who came in contact with Robert experienced bad luck, as if the doll was getting even for all the years he had been made a scapegoat. The curse of Robert the doll grew into such a well-known legend in Key West, Florida, that whenever things Florida. went wrong, locals would simply shrug and say, blame it on Robert. But Robert's real fame came when the Chucky horror film series, Child's Play, came out, as they were said to have been modeled on the real-life story of Robert the doll. There are many theories about why Robert behaves the way he does. Some believe it's an ancient curse, others say it's voodoo. Still, others insist that Gene Otto's ghost has returned to the doll whom he loved so much. The museum cats seem to believe in Robert's dark powers. They keep their distance when staring up at the glass. <laughs> There's a glass case in East Martello Museum where Robert is enthroned. Oh. People, on the other hand, tend to doubt the legend and have suffered the consequences. Letters Ooh. scattered at Robert's feet and ta tacked up to the adjacent wall are testimonials from dozens of unbelievers Ooh. who were cursed by Robert the doll, such as this one. <laughs> we'll wake up in the middle of the night I'm just gonna see Walter in that mask Honestly? on my bedside just can you see <laughs> on that mask <laughs> nah, nah this way oh, you wear an eye us. mask now you wear an eye mask you, you don't get sleep, sleep could, demons could you see that could you see through it what were you, you able to see out of the mask what mask he's gaslighting us gaslighting us wake up Walter <laughs> wake up Walter <laughs> wake up wake up, wake up. Wake up. Wake up. Wake up. Wake you can see out that mask right uh, yeah 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 you can see out the mask is that what you wear for Halloween? <laughs> <laughs> Is that what uh, you wear no, for Halloween? What was I for Halloween? Yeah, I was drunk as fuck for Halloween. <laughs> <laughs> I, I went. I, I I dressed up as a wasted ass. Mm. That's crazy. So, so the lady took a picture and she's like, Robert and I were introduced several days ago and so far I suffered no ill effects, but then I'm not taking any chances. Like the cats, I choose to believe. Mm -hmm. So yeah, Florida. So it's Robert the Dolls in Florida. So if we ever go to Florida, we're going to go down to Disney World. We're going to go down to Universal Studios World. We're going to go down to uh, all the theme parks they got in Florida. And we'll make sure to visit uh, Make sure to visit Robert the Doll. Robert Downey make Jr. Sure to, uh, make sure to take a shit. Robert Downey Jr. the Doll. <laughs> <laughs> and it's Robert Downey Jr. in blackface from Robert, 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 Robert Downey Robert Downey Biden Jr. <laughs> Robert Downey Biden James Jr. <laughs> Robert Downey Biden James Johnson Jingo Heimer Schmidt Jr. Robert F. Downey. Um. So yeah. Uh, so anyways, Robert what was Downey? next on the docket? That's all we have. Have y'all seen Have y'all seen Scott Pilgrim? I have no the, uh, not. the cartoon. The, the one it's, that good. Mm. it's good. No, no, no. I, it's good. It's well illustrated. I it's saw the good. first so episode, good. like ten minutes of it, but I got the the twist spoiled. You guys all know it already, right? Yeah. Michael. Yes. I don't yeah. watch it all. You haven't watched it all. Though? I watched it all. Oh, you watched it all. Okay. Yeah. I haven't watched it all. I haven't watched it all either. I but I got the twist spoiled where he dies in the first episode, and then it's Ramona's. Story. Did you guys watch the new Doctor Who episode? Not, not yet. Not yet. I'm good. I'm barely finishing up on well, Matt Smith's run. Stoop. Scott Pilgrim. What do you think about the Scott Pilgrim? Scott Pilgrim. I, I I like it. They uh they basically made all the uh the subtext of the original works into just text, text. <laughs> <laughs> into just text. Because people couldn't fucking handle any amounts of media analysis yeah. whatsoever. <laughs> uh, so I like that. I so think, does I think he actually die funny. in the first episode? Uh, no, not as far as I know. What? Wait, did you finish Scott Pilgrim or no? No, I haven't. Have you seen the first episode at least? <clears throat> I've seen most of the... Edward, just just give up on TV. You're not good at watching TV. <laughs> in most of the first episode. I'm not good at watching, at watching TV. TV. I can't sit there for an hour. What do Honestly, I look like? You have to. No, it's because I'm also I've been trying to watch like there's too many things I'm trying to watch in a row. I'm rewatching One Piece with uh with Farnoosh. Uh, I I got her into it. See, You're rewatching so you One Piece. You don't yeah. you don't gotta be doing that. <laughs> Honestly, yeah. Have her catch up and then come to you when she's at Wano. That's and it. then uh and then I'm rewatching <laughs> Doctor Who. I'm later. at Matt Smith. <laughs> I'm at Matt Smith's. Rewatching Doctor He. Yeah. For what, man? Uh, for for the new. But you don't remember anything, you know. I remember, remember most of it, but like you know, 
getting and back and into and it. Water. And did you do so, you understand? Like I technically up until now, all of the all of the like modern Doctor Who or whatever, uh, I technically haven't watched over half of it because I stopped around the end of Capaldi. Around the uh, oh, so you don't watch any of the Jody stuff? When no, I haven't watched any of the Jody stuff, and that's like half of what, like all of Doctor Who up until now. It went from like Jody. I saw like the the main thing I remember from Matt Smith, like Translore and everything. That was like season seven or something, season season seven, season eight, and they're on like season thirteen, season fourteen now. So literally, mm. like over half of it I haven't watched. Wait, you never saw all of Capaldi? Yeah. I I watched a lot of Capaldi, not all of it per se. I watched that was when I started watching more like sporadic yeah. like i watched some episodes here some episodes there i didn't yeah, watch it I, I, I never i never finished capaldi's run either i never yeah. saw him regenerate you guys are fucking wack yeah so half half of all doctor <laughs> who, i just haven't seen it so hey, edward you're like anti-algorithm dude <laughs> you don't watch the new shit and then you're you're missing you're incomplete on like everything else like what the heck <laughs> i bet you haven't even finished ahsoka have you no i have not i'm, I'm still either. watching andor dude I'm still Andor. watching Andor. Fuck Andor, That's, dude. Andor's the no, worst. It's Andor. the worst Star Wars. No, it's not. No, it's Fuck not. You. It's no, amazing. it's not. It's fucking Fuck great. You. It's fucking it is so the worst boring. Star Wars. You're so boring. boring. It's not. You want to oh see? You want to see? Pew pew pew. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Dude, this guy. That's why he wants Clone Wars to see. Pew 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 pew. I need explosions. Oh no! Did you ever hear about that bad TV show, The West Wing? You know, there's there's no there's no bullets in it. Honestly, like what? There's barely anything. So slow. They're just talking yeah. you guys ever seen Why succession they all they do is oh. talk about business so boring nah you have to fuck watch. boring dialogue dude what the fuck what oh my you? god everything is so je- yesterday jessica so she took bad. a sip of my water and no, i didn't know she took a sip I, of my water it, but like wait you on, s- like, andor i watched it for like three episodes i'm like dude i just can't get into it there's nothing appealing what nothing what was, appealing dude, these characters are flat no they're not no they are not it doesn't matter it doesn't flat matter. Flat characters? Yes, it doesn't where? Matter. Niggas and don't where matter. Where do you see flat hey, characters? Before you even get they to Andy matter. Circus, it's already just, I can't watch it up to that point. Bad. Well, let Should me... I, s- you haven't even seen Clone Wars. Shut the fuck up. Yeah, have, fuck you guys. What, what the fuck? I, what, fuck you. I have do, seen Clone Wars. Do you know Wars? why what I've never seen Clone Wars? Because I've never had cable, so I never saw oh, it. I, I don't have cable, but I, you have. You oh, can watch anything now, motherfucker. I'm poor. Yes. I'm poverty. But, but there's there's like 10 years of Clone Wars to catch up oh, on. Oh, dude, there's oh like God. five seasons, yeah. dude. It's there's like, like 13 seasons, dude. I caught up with fucking 40 Doctor episodes. Who. It's, or I am. I don't have that kind of free time, okay? I barely. I Dude, I watch it while you're driving. This guy. Oh, wa- of course. <laughs> Let me just be distracted <laughs> yeah. while I'm driving on my yeah. three. What do you watch? Work. What do you watch while you're at work, dude? Because you'd be watching shit. You what? know, you'd be watching. I you'd be watch watching success. You said you instead of watching fucking Succession, watch fucking Clone <laughs> Wars, dude. Nah. <laughs> Succession exactly. is better. Succession uh, is. I don't know about that like one. Succession. I don't know about that. It's better than some parts of the Clone Wars. I don't okay. think it's better overall. Let me ask you a question. How many Emmys has the Clone Wars won? Ah! No, 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 This got an Emmy. Emmys. Fucking the Sopranos is one of the best shows of all time, though. Let's compare actual live action humans. The metrics of the Emmys, dude. Oh my god. Sopranos against Succession. Okay. Ah. Emmys. Ah. Sopranos is gonna destroy it, bro. How many oh. awards has it won? Anyways, did this white person make you cry? <laughs> <laughs> Have an Emmy. I I felt it how with much the white did they people. pay for that Emmy? <laughs> yeah, it was great. It was great. Um, <laughs> Succession is a great show. <laughs> Only finished the first season, so no spoilers. So, <sighs> anyways, Clone Wars, Ahsoka. Oh, I haven't finished Ahsoka either. Two episodes behind. Um, Loki. I haven't even finished, started Ahsoka. We, Loki? we finished Loki. Yeah, but you finished Loki, didn't you? Yeah, I finished Loki. Fucking Loki was fucking great. Yeah, just, just like a month later after it finished, you finished. No, no, no. I finished yeah. it when it when it came out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I watched it. I watched it as it came out. She was great. I think like two days afterwards or so, because we were telling him you didn't see it. He's like, no, not the newest one. We were like, ah, yeah, yeah. Uh, because it was like Thursday. It comes out Thursday yeah, yeah, at six yeah. p.m. You know, he's out selling at that time. Yeah. Well, technically, Thursdays I'm at the card shop. Thursdays card shop day. Thursdays card oh, shop yeah, day. At the card shop, I sell an ass. You could be pulling up on your phone like. <laughs> Honestly, I I do do that. Like when I'm out selling lamps, I do have it on my phone. I'm just there watching shit. Just watch mm, Ahsoka at like one and a half speed. But Andor was really good, dude. Like, Andor was really. There, good. there was such tragic characters in that one where he's trying to. One of the guys is trying to escape a prison, and then there's only ocean below, and everyone's jumping because they're like, "Yay, we escaped!" Right? And then he looks at him, and the guy who tried so hard to escape, and he's like, "I can't swim." And then it's like, "That's ah uh, ah." Uh, uh. 
Ah, oh, he fucking dies because uh, obviously the Imperials come back and then they're like, "Who's escaping from?" How's this related to Star Wars? Uh, Andor, the, the character Andor. That's how. That's it. Uh, no, because they they talk about him and the other systems. How like it, there's rebellions and stuff. And okay, uh, you now know, let's see the how of it. the Clone Wars is related to Star Wars. You got the fucking. You got the pew pew pew. You got the pew pew pew. You got the light star. You got the light star. Building right now is it started in the show, dude. You got the magic. This is great. Clone Wars contributes to the actual story of Star Wars. Andor is Andor is nothing except Andor side missions. Oh, you know, you know all all the all the small planets where like you just follow a random clone trooper. All of those don't matter. I asked you how the fuck does Andor how does Andor relate to Star Wars, and you guys said Andor. That's it. So like, what the fuck? That's because nothing. Andor is one of the ones that got the original um, Death Star plans before. So he, that's it. Before he got killed. So we're just learning a bunch of pointless bullshit to his character. How is it pointless? Technically, I've already seen Clone Wars. The whole point of listen, it listen. is the story. No, 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 no. no, no hold I on. Got them. I got them. Okay, okay. I've seen Clone Wars. I saw the movie. I don't need all the extra <laughs> bullshit. I've seen the actual movie. There you go. Why do I need the extra bullshit? <laughs> the movie. Is yeah. one mission or one battle no, within a like couple of battles. hundreds of battles? It's a couple of battles, the but they call it the Clone Wars. Wars. So why yeah. do I need it? Why do I need? Why do I need the series? I don't need the series. You need more than one. You need no, more I don't. Than what? No, I don't. No, that's true. No, that's true. I'm Going asking by your you, guys's how logic, does the story? That's what I need. No, that's I'm asking you. you I'm asking you, what does the story of the Andor show? The rebellion add to the fucking it's Star Wars the, story. It's the spores of the rebellion. It adds because it has, the story of Andor, like what Mothma. he's doing. What? It's what? No, Andor. it just gives you. A, it just. It just gives the character no, 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 an arc. No. That's all that. She, it's like an, an origin. No, no. And it what? shows. Uh, understand? It, no, hold on. It, wait, wait, it all, it understand also what you show. are saying. What you are saying through implication is that. Doesn't a matter. story needs more reason than the story itself existing in order to justify. It's itself. like if they made a fucking that show about Count Dooku. You don't need a whole story. story. Yes, it'd be good. That yes, is the worst it'd be example. good. It'd be good. And I would but agree. Dead. But it's a character I like, and it's a character I would like to see, and it's a character that's actually more important to Star Wars. But even so, oh. even so, if it would just be a so a story about Kanduku and not really adding to the story to you Star never, Wars, you never need. I'm you asking, never need a more story. unless there's specific wait, wait. things wait. in Count Dooku that that do. That's like me. That's that like me do, saying that wh- do add to the fucking no, actual story. Why do I need a Count Dooku story? He dies anyway. I already know how it ends. Well, why? Why you do we know, need to you know? You don't understand the what I'm fucking of saying. Vader. Why exactly. do we need to know that he used to be Anakin? You, for a story, any story, you never <sighs> need more elaboration because, on something. Because it's a Skywalker no, saga. No, yeah, that, 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 was about the that was after. That was after. This is before the Skywalkers. Yeah, this is before the Skywalkers, dude. Who? Dude, before need, they were a it's thing. It's not the Andor saga. It doesn't matter. Andor, it doesn't dude. matter. <laughs> it's called the Star Wars, not the fucking... Not the Skywalker. Skywalker. <laughs> this is Skywalker movie one. Yeah. yeah. It's called Star Wars. Star Wars. Star Wars. And usually during war, literally war, the, one of the most political things. Of course, it's going to be ripe for political intrigue and in fucking shows representing that thing. Okay. If, you want it, if you want it, there's like, a lot of that in... Come Kong. on. A lot more than Andor, and it's better. It's way better. I don't know, oh man. God. I've never seen it, so therefore it can't be better than something uh, I've seen. <laughs> Clone Wars isn't isn't just a, a, a I've seen the movie a side fucking enough. story of one character. I've had enough. It's it's yeah, but it's unneeded. an additional who who plot. needed to know that that Anakin had a Padawan? Who needed yeah. to know that Darth Vader had a matter? Padawan? Yeah, why, why does that matter? Said Clone Wars is unneeded. Yeah, what about by, by, by your guys' logic. It's intrinsically never needed. No, 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 no. Like by your guys' logic, it is not needed. Nothing okay. is added to the movie. Okay, 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 okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, and it's I know, not needed. And I know it's who not needed. It's not needed. It's not needed. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. It's not needed. Hold on. It's not. It's not needed. It's not needed. It's not needed if you don't. If you don't care about knowing the in-depth story of Darth Vader, of and of Obi Wan, of Anakin. If you don't care, it doesn't matter. You can watch, no, no, no. yeah. You can just watch just six, matter. seven, and eight, and not really know, and like, oh, who yeah. gives a fuck yeah. about Darth Vader in his past? That's yeah. true. Yes. So the same thing is, is applying to to Clone Wars. If you don't want to watch Clone Wars, it's fine. But you don't really care to know about those characters. That's fine. But Andor isn't a character that I think is important enough, or even at the same level as. The characters that are in Clone Wars, such yeah, as and I'm Darth saying Vader, that that's all irrelevant, and I'm saying that's all that's that, all no, no, relevant. No, and I'm saying the important that's, characters and, and, no, no, are what no, no, make no, the Star no, Wars no, no. series, and not saying, the side and I'm characters that's that all don't irrelevant. matter. The only thing a story needs is to be good. If they can tell a good story with specific characters, that's all that matters. It doesn't necessarily <laughs> yeah. ma- matter if like they're super important to that. Is the story itself good? That is the only justification a story needs. Yeah. Is the story because that can just you means that just because by that logic you can just you can any because because by that logic because by that logic you can just be a fanfic to anything 
and then just be like, this is my story. It's fucking good. Yeah, as, as long as it's fucking good. High key, you <laughs> can make what <laughs> are you Are you a bitch that lets corporations tell you what is and isn't good? Uh, exactly. good no, I'm just no, saying it doesn't exactly. fucking like, matter. On. It's like if you're making, if All I, that matters if I, that it's good. Yeah. If I make a story about my own OC character in the Star Wars universe and I call it Star Wars, it's like, okay, is it Star Wars or is it just taking place in the Star okay, Wars universe? Okay, then. What, that, what would not, you I don't feel Ahsoka? right calling it. What would you call Ahsoka? She's a character established in the story. What the fuck are you talking about? It's not like she's not Andor. Dave Filoni was not originally a part of the of the Clone Wars. He was not originally a part of the original Star Wars. It is his OC. What does that mean? That means that Ahsoka is just canonized She's OC. In canon, it's dude. just canonized yeah. OC. Fan it's fan It's canon fan fiction. That's but all she that was is. Canon, it comes dude. past. It doesn't matter. She was it comes, a long time it, ago. It doesn't, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It was not originally created by the creators. It was not a part of the original, original canon. She sure. did not She's exist not in any prior. Of the She's not in any of but the movies. Was, but she still but a was, She's still a character. She's a character. She became a character. She's only a character regardless, because regardless, someone decided. Yes. Regardless. So, She's an important character. And that matters. Proving my point that the only thing that matters is that the stories are good. How about That's this? That's the only thing that matters. How about this? Andrew's a great story, right? But, but you're that means, but uh, you're I mean, okay, me so so if my story is good enough, that means like my original character would be like, I want him to be, play a big part in the in the in the in the saga that took place between the Skywalkers. I wanted my character to have influence, and I want him to be now retconned into the mainstream story. Then now anyone can do. It. No, that's horseshit. Then make it good. That's We're horseshit. Talking about the actual Edward TV said show anyone can make it good. Then make it good. I'm talking about okay. How make about it this? good. If, if you make it good let's, enough, let's I'm go sure less. that the fucking studios will be willing to do something. If, and, I, and, and then hold on, hold on, hold on. That's why no, 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 no. Yes, that's why Ahsoka came about because she's not originally a part of it. If you make it good enough. And you're hired, and you're, and you're the yes, studios will make it a part Andor of the canon. But Andor isn't Andor as a character important. It does not, it's not as important as Ahsoka. For, and that so matter. even less to complain. So because even less that's for why, you to that's complain why about. I don't think, that's so so I don't think it deserves that. That's why I don't think so it deserves. Right, no, your so that's issue. why I don't think your it deserves the title issue. of it being a Star Wars title. It should just be something like your in the galaxy, issue? Star Wars Listen. galaxy, or something like that. Yeah, he is just in the Star Wars. No, it shouldn't be called Star Wars. It should just be called Star Galaxy or something like that. Stupid. Listen, 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 listen. Star Wars is just the overarching thing, right? It's like saying it's not a Marvel movie. It's a Spider-Man movie, right? Listen, listen. Yeah. Andor is one of the central figurehead of the rebels that steals oh, the man. Death Star plans right, right, right. that lets them blow it up. Right. How is that not okay. important? That's why Rogue One is good. Not fucking Andor, bruh. But Rogue we find One out was the movie you referred Andor to. Andor is right great here. because it goes from him not giving a shit and being apathetic to the to, like an everyday person that okay. goes, "What yes. can I do about look, it? Look, I look, can't look, do look, 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 so look, 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 the only difference here is that with Andor, the shit that you're not, the shit that wasn't shown in Rogue One, you don't really need to know more about Andor that wasn't told in Rogue One to like to really for it to matter or be a, for it to it, uh, impact the Star Wars story. Same you thing with as, Clone Wars. Where, Same thing with Clone Wars. Whereas if you don't watch Clone Wars, it does matter. No, it doesn't. Why? It does not matter. It does not matter. What have you I get the full story on? without yeah. needing to watch Clone I've Wars. I missed out on nothing. Yeah, you missed okay. out on literally nothing. Well, okay. Nothing. Well, who's Cad Bane? Who's the Night Sisters? Who are the fucking Mandalorians? Do they matter? Do they matter to the movies? Do they matter to the story of the movies? Do they matter to the story of the movies? They don't matter to the main story. Sam Wessel does not matter to the story despite being the main assassin that tries to kill Padme. She does not matter. She does not matter. She's just filling a role of an assassin. By the it end, doesn't matter, matter to by you. The end of, it doesn't you, matter to you, you, but it matters watch to everyone it does, else. No, it doesn't it matter to the story. It, matters, it, does it does not matter to the story. It does not affect the story. It does. It does. Whether, whether oh. Sam Wessel was named Sam Wessel or Pupu Kaka, it does not matter to the fucking story. It does not matter. It does not matter. It matters because at the end of it, how so? So if you palette swap Sam Wessel with anyone else, it simply matters for this reason. It simply matters for this fucking reason because if you're watching it, you're if you're watching without watching the Clone Wars shows by the end of when you're watching part six or whatever thing you're watching whatever episode you want to watch you're watching these characters in a different perspective you're watching them from perspective a less same thing with andor less, right? same thing with answer yes but exactly, it doesn't matter exactly. if you don't but it doesn't yes, matter no, with it andor it doesn't, it doesn't matter, matter with anyone it, does. it doesn't matter it matters no, no, no. with the main They're characters of the star wars no it doesn't it matter it does not characters. matter <laughs> it does not matter it matters with main characters it matters with main characters you get all the info you need in the movie you get all the you know what you know what you know what you know what it's not because it does matter because I didn't watch Rebels and I'm yeah. kind of lost in Ahsoka. So it does matter that I watch That's watched a TV show, not the movies. Make, this should make sense. Next. 
That's the movies. That's not the movies. That's the TV show. That's a side story. Yeah. That's a side story. You're just describing another side story, not supporting another side story. I don't give a shit about that, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because the movie was wrong. It does matter. None of them matter. Are you counting? No, 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 no. That's why none of them matter. It does matter because if you're counting the fucking the sequels, it does matter. If you're counting the storylines of the sequels, Why? the new shows do Why? matter because it gives you So then the prequels don't matter. They only matter the original trilogy. Are Wait. you going to say Wait. that we need to watch the Clone Wars to see the uh, to, to understand the original trilogy? No, no, no. But I'm, I'm no, not you're no, getting you a don't. more. Getting a no, more you don't. I'm saying, I'm saying all the Star Wars movies, right? Of the, of the sequels now with an addition what? of the shows. That's what it yeah, adds yeah, to but, it. But yeah, yeah, it adds Adding to it. But that does nothing. Watching Andor does nothing. It is unneeded because even though it adds something, it does not. you're not missing out on anything. Listen, listen. When you're watching the TV show, show Andor you're watching again you're watching a disillusioned guy turn into a rebel and so that way when you watch the actual movie you're like wow I'm super attached to this guy and then he dies and then you were super attached to all these characters right which might have still happened if you had seen the movie without watching Andor but if you watch the actual Star Wars movies nothing no one gives a shit about anything you never yeah. even hear about the Mandalorian Wars you never hear about fucking baby Grogu nothing it doesn't matter yeah, it doesn't these matter these side stories are irrelevant to the main Skywalker saga right because the Skywalker yeah, they is, never right? they never right? say Andor's name they say a group of rebels they don't say Andor they that's, say a group of rebels I understand that but that's the thing that's 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 how that's how you expand on a story. You take a single line of dialogue and then you turn it into a fucking movie that's oh. amazing, that's great. Oh, you're and I knew your show. father when we fought in the Clone Wars, headed as. Exactly. Like yeah, yeah, they yeah, turned yeah, that into a whole movie. Yeah, so like come on. You're literally, watching a story you're watching a story literally of a depressed irrelevant. fucking dude that's that fucking lost his dad. Movie. You're and watching a school getting... shooter story, but with yeah. lightsabers. <laughs> that's what it really is. But then when you watch Clone Wars, it's no longer just a small like detail. You yeah, have you're now, right. When you watch you Andor, have more backstory to it. When you watch but Andor, Andor you doesn't matter to the main yes. story. So, Andres, neither that's neither do is... the main character. The, 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 the main characters don't matter, matter to the no, main no, story. Wait, wait, the no. main characters Walter, don't matter to the main story. Walter just helped me out. Walter said they just give you a small line, and now we expand on that small line with our TV show. So you have more additions. So we do have more. Wow! 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 All well, of these George side Lucas stories, didn't make the, the thing is that you guys are requiring either. something fuck. extra you for these side stories either. to exist. This is the issue that's happening. You guys are requiring something extra for a for Andor to justify its own existence. When the no, only no, justification just for that it needs... No, no, no. Not for requirement. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good. It's just for good. It for it to matter. It for it to be a show that's like, wow, this is... this is This character is so important and it's good. You guys are trying to impose an extra restriction on art existing, which is that you need it to be justified somehow. You need it to be justifying its own existence somehow when it doesn't really require that and the thing that's why it's so easy to push back against this like yes the clone wars do not matter they add to the story but they do not intrinsically matter to the original story why because the original story is already complete you have the three movies you have it everything all the information you need to understand the characters of the film are already inside of that film and so there is no need to have extra stuff but it is good to why because there's good stories to be told within these universes outside of that and you guys trying to everyone add knows Anakin and Darth Vader throughout the whole series no, and of Star everyone, Wars. No one knows and Andor everyone, after matter. Andor and, dies. And, yeah, and this is this is the same thing. That's well, exactly oh, it. Oh, Anakin dies. Uh, Anakin dies uh, in the end. Oh, wow. It doesn't uh, matter. Everyone still it knows Anakin after and it before. Did, it didn't matter that, that he was in the Clone but Wars because he dies in the end. now people do know Andor like, okay. because they gave No one <laughs> knows Andor I'm after he saying. dies besides the yeah, audience. Right. In the story of Star Wars, everyone talks about them <laughs> even after they die. Oh, That's really? Oh, really? So when when was the last time Anakin was mentioned by the Mandalorian? Yeah. What do you mean the Mandalorian? That that happens post right? his death. That happens post all yeah, of that. Yeah, so so, so presumably if, you if talk people about know him in the universe, they talk about it in Ahsoka. What are you talking about? Yeah, but that's Ahsoka. Yeah, that's Ahsoka. Right? That's Ahsoka. Mandalorian. Book of Mandalorian. Fett, they never yeah, talk yeah, about yeah. him. When, so when did Boba so, Fett mention so him? So it's not relevant. Is that what you're that's all the same. That's all the same fucking story. Skywalker's in there. Okay. Andor. Andor has an eight point four out of ten on IMDb with the final episode having a nine point four out of ten. You're telling me you wouldn't watch a show that was rated that high? But but people. But people like you give those awards yeah. out. So why yeah. would I trust that? I'm not <laughs> giving this award out. I am simply And those aren't awards. Those are, those are no, those people are like ratings. Yeah, this is like what? ratings. Like, come yeah, on. You're saying like, oh, people, people said it's good, so I think it's not good. <laughs> yeah. I, I, will call, I will call bullshit out. <laughs> Secret Invasion. Dog shit. Yeah, Everyone dog thought it was literally, dog literally, shit. Literally, it was I'm not like saying they're the the the, listen, the quality listen, the quality listen, of listen. the show She Hulk is was shit. really good, but it got review bombed by incels. Yes, and we can actually see that because if you look at the distribution of male versus female ratings, female ratings are like average, while male ratings are disproportionately low, and then like average, obviously like average females, high. Females don't watch the same amount of fucking Marvel movies as males though. 
No, no, I know so that. I don't think that, but, that's, but, but that's that's but, that's counting by by population. So it's yeah, yeah. taking a uh, but. But I'm per, saying per capita. That's what but I'm called. saying per you, capita. You see how many of the guys are just like oh, this is a fucking she uh, MCU blah, blah blah. But it's like, dude, yeah. they've had like four female leads. Like, relax, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's chill, my chill, point. Chill, and chill, it wasn't chill. as bad as people going. It's like a it's like a one one star out but of ten. Get, get back not. to the point. Get back to the main point. Point is, Andor being that ra- high, highly rated, I think, and also having watched it. I will trust that it is a good TV show more than Walter it going, I felt flat. Okay, I look, like look, it. look, like, you, you saying it's a good TV show, like, but like if it's a good story, yes. I, haven't, I haven't read it. Yeah. I mean, I haven't, I haven't seen the story. If it's a good story. You haven't seen Andor? If, no. If the characters, if the characters. Okay. How about this? If the how characters about this? We'll are, watch all of Andor and you, you watch all the Clone Wars and we'll be even. Okay, that works. And then, all right. If the characters are related, episodes if the, versus 50 if the story episodes. is interesting, that's like, that's if like the nine hours are relatable, compared to like 30 days if, worth if of it, stuff. And if it matters to, if it matters, <laughs> I guess it doesn't matter to the main story. So I can only count on those two other factors. For me, for it to be interesting to me, for me to continue to be like, oh, this is worth watching. Otherwise, I don't think it's worth let's, watching. Let's put some kinetic sand next for it to, to be, Andor For it to be, for it to be considered, because it doesn't. It's like, I'm watching Star Wars to know about the Star Wars and the main characters of Star Wars. I don't Why? care about a side character that died a long time ago for, no, for some bullshit, dude. So, uh, so why not, not a main character of the Star Wars? Yeah, no matter not. how much she's a fan favorite, she's not a main character of the Star Wars. She's it's not. a Skywalker saga. Yep. So if by your by your own logic, the all of Ahsoka same. doesn't 8. matter. 8. All of Ahsoka You're doesn't tied. matter to the to the and main story of Star Wars. She's like, a main character because she plays a Jedi she's not a main character, in the though. Star she's not Wars. She's not a Jedi either. She hasn't been a Jedi forever. She was a Jedi. She hasn't been a Jedi forever. She herself rejects the label. So that doesn't so, matter. No. She was uh, the so, point no. is. Oh, it doesn't matter what the character. Yeah, it doesn't matter what the characters say. do. Yeah, she's, yeah, yeah, yeah. she's a main yeah. character. She's a main character she's because not. Ahsoka loves she's not me a main because I said Star Wars it. Saga. No matter how much of a fan favorite she is, like she's technically not the main character of the Skywalker saga. I'm not she's saying she's not the main. No one's saying she's the main character. No one's saying she's the main character. She's not the main character. No one's saying she's the main character of Star Wars saga. No one's saying she is a main character. I said she's not a main character. She's a main character. She's a main character. Unimportant. She's not even in any of the movies. If she was important, she's not technically. She movie. was. She was as Which just one? the voice. Edward, as a you ghost. hate women. Oh, ghost. like what is going on? <laughs> <laughs> I don't hate. She women. actually was. In the, she's, she's, she is technically in the in the, in so the Star Wars universe. She's dead because she's a force. Ghost. Oh yeah, yeah that's she's true. a force. Ghost. She's dead. Nice. So she's just or dead. So, in another so universe. we're gonna we're or gonna backtrack universe. on our previous we're statement of like I don't I don't care about like a dead person that yeah you know that influencing the the story doesn't matter. You what, need to hear me. Or she's in another universe. She could be trapped in another universe. You don't even know yet. Oh yeah, that's true. That's true. Why is she trapped in another universe? We're seeing her in the main universe, no? I haven't finished it. Uh, did, don't tell did me anything. You, uh, you didn't finish, uh, 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 finish the uh, uh, uh. No, oh, I haven't said... Uh, okay, I'm done. I'm going to kill myself now. Wow. <laughs> All right. No spoilers. Wow. Anyways, um, so my point being, it's a good show. Watch all of Andor. I promise you, as long as you're not going, oh, they're just talking, like, you're going to like it. Because remember, half the movies are just political discourse. Why does it and matter? And the other half is yeah. like... Bzz, 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 bzz. Because it's good. It's good and, storytelling. And it does have some of the other main characters. Mon Mothma. She was in several of the movies. Someone She's can make a good story about like a couple of, of a couple of sponges that are different colors, and it can be a political segment or to make it interesting and make it an interesting story. But at the end of listen, it, it's, listen, it's listen. a story about sponges, and I'm not gonna sit down and watch a sponge cartoon, dude. SpongeBob, you <laughs> like SpongeBob? Like <laughs> you piece of shit. You <laughs> fucking, fucking fascist piece of foot, garbage. <laughs> You're a Nazi because you don't like SpongeBob. You heard it here, folks. This Nazi <laughs> hates America. He hates freedom. He hates Steven Hilberg. Everything it stands for. SpongeBob is as American as apple pie. <laughs> I you accidentally reinvent here. SpongeBob. <laughs> yeah, Sponge, SpongeBob is like some pansexual, transgender sponge. Like, I don't even know what the fuck he is. He's, exactly He's asexual, fuck. technically, because he never fucks. <laughs> He has no gender, dude. <laughs> There's no dick, no balls, no nothing. No <laughs> Man, I ball so hard, they thought I was a fucking nuts. He has holes. He just has holes, dude. Yeah. Um. So at uh, the end of the day, you got my point, and it's the end. And you know, and that's why you're laughing. <laughs> And going the, and the I'm way. laughing at the okay. lack of I'm literacy. laughing at the fact that you that in order to try to like have a, like a last dunk or instead something of, instead of you, you, you like just reinvented no 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 and like no like no just no. replace just replace you like shot no, yourself in the shut foot shut the fuck up <laughs> just replace sponge with a spoon there, there. spoon bob <laughs> that's not a thing see there there I mean, no, there's no longer funny it's no longer funny nobody thinks about I'm talking about a regular metal spoon a metal spoon metal spoons talking to each other all right all right 
then like it would like no like you know, at the end of the day. Who cares and about who cares about metal spoons talking to each other? If it's not ever. good, then that, that negates the whole point. But the basis <laughs> yeah. is the fact that good stories deserve to exist just by the sheer Correct. fact that they are good. Yeah, but Correct. if it's but a story about matters. spoons talking to if each other, good, it, that doesn't matter. I don't care about spoons. Is it good? Is it good? You could write an award-winning short film with fucking shells, dude. Dude, didn't they fucking do that? Yes. Didn't Pixar do that with fucking dumplings? They fucking did that with dumplings, dude. Like right now, right? Right now. Right hand, you have Clone Wars. Right, left hand, you have fucking Andor. Which one do you keep? The other one has to be erased forever. Well, that's not Edward. valid. Yeah. That's Edward. Not, you can equally no. enjoy them yeah. without no, going. Let him, let, let him answer. Let him no, answer. no, no, no. Answer, answer that, other. actually. No. Answer that. Fucking perfect question, dude. Fucking neither, then. Edward, I don't fucking care. Do They're side keep? stories. They don't matter. True They're side stories. They don't matter. Face. Eliminate them both. Face. Eliminate them both. <laughs> Eliminate them both. <laughs> they can't answer both. They can't answer the question, so they sabotage the Eliminate them both. Fuck it. Eliminate them both. That's not a valid question. Yeah, yeah, it's not. It's not a valid question. 100% is. 100% is. It is an intrinsic. Well, my dad can beat up your dad. Yeah, it's uh, one of those questions. Like, that's not, that's yeah. not valid. A valid, a valid question, question. I think they both have good the things, merit. and they yes. both. Uh, one is more important. One is one point. is more important. No, they, they that's why you. Both that's, do why, not that's why. They literally do not. They, yeah, both, tech, they both matter. Technically, equally. they do we not boil matter. it down to yeah. brass tacks. Neither of them matter. Neither of them matter. Neither of them matter. The but only story... Uh, the says the person that didn't watch, watch something, it. Says the good? person that didn't watch is it the good? shit. But I'm saying... Oh but I'm saying... God. I watched both. both. I watched both. So you True. can't use that with me. True. I did watch both. And I think they both have their own good things. Their own... They both have their own okay, bad so things. so pick right now. And I like pick, them. Pick one. Pick neither. One. Neither. He neither doesn't have to. Joke's I don't, on you. Yeah. He doesn't have like, to. He's an adult. He can make his own decisions. But yeah. Like... All that, that all that matters is that, is it good? Is it good to watch? Is it good to watch? That's all that matters. That's all, right. all that matters. All right. You, best show. Ass. Best show on Corn Cop TV right now. Coffin Flop. Anyone else got any other shows? On um, what? On, don't, on don't Corn Cop TV. That, I don't watch Coffin that. Coffin Flop. You guys don't have Corn Cop TV. You guys have cable. You guys, you guys watch have you watch cable Network and fucking and 2023. I was going to say, I don't have fucking cable. <laughs> I don't have cable. You're finally, I, you're finally able to buy cable, and you're like, I got cable. And I, I, I got to watch Corn Cop TV, dude. I got to watch Corn Cop TV. You shitting me? The, He's like, I never watched Car- uh, Comedy Central last night. <laughs> <laughs> they, they had the new up and coming on Comedy Central, guys. Reruns of uh, Undress Watches Bet to keep up with like B E T. Uh, it's not called Bet. <laughs> bet. Bet. It's called bet. B-E-T. Bet. Bet. Bet is not called B E T Comics. Okay. <laughs> Black Entertainment Tonight. <laughs> BET. He watches B E T. I watch Bet. Dude. He watches Bet. Did you guys Bet. watch Jersey Shore on Matt? Uh, Jersey Shore? <laughs> Joyzy? I love Joyzy. We're going Shore. down to Joyzy? <sighs> oh, shit. Dude. All right. We got like 10 minutes left after all this fucking yelling. So, my point is, <laughs> and Edward's point is, good stories can exist on the merit of simply being good. Mm-hmm. They don't have to be intrinsically tied. That's like Marvel movies. You can have a good Marvel movie that's standalone, like Shang-Chi, where you don't have to necessarily go in and be like, oh my god, guys, um, you guys know that, like this unknown character is popping in yeah. and whatnot. I mean, yeah, I know they do that at the end anyway, but Shang-Chi by itself is a great movie. Dude, Eternals by itself is a great movie. Mr. You know, protecting the Earth, even though it was going to explode a billion different times and, and whatnot, right? But they're, they're still good. In fact, movies. they kind of needs to. They, you kind of need to have those fil- those types of uh, extra side things to fill out the universe, or else it feels too of small. Course. If every single media that comes out of the, out of one thing they're is just focusing Tatooine on one thing, again, yeah, yeah, yeah. Tatooine again, for the 30th time. Again, yeah, Fuck like off. it goes the opposite way. Like people would be complaining Sam. about that. It's coarse and rough like, and gets yeah. everywhere. <laughs> Yeah. Like you got a long ass finger. <laughs> <laughs> Just a. <laughs> no. That's what. And uh, fucking Michael's entire argument. No. No. Uh, no. <laughs> Denied. <coughs> These guys are loony. Y'all lame, yeah. Um, so I, I think Michael should still take the recommended courses we told him in ELAC for free. Yeah. <laughs> They're free. Psych. I'm going to go take motorcycle courses. Go, go take Psych 101. Go take Media Literacy. Go take Debate Class. I think de- Debate Class, if anything, would be the most Master Debate Class. Master Debate Class. <laughs> I'm a master debater. Um, yeah, you, you, there's a couple of classes we really think you should take. History 101, obviously. Um, speech. Uh, you should You should get... Um, oh, no. Bitches 101. Yeah. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> How to be a player 101. <laughs> I learned that one in the streets of community college of a Compton Community College. 
I just need to I just need to memorize Dracula Flow three, and that's all I need. That's my that's my fucking certification right there. Yeah, that's my credential. You, you go to get a job at, at Wall Street, just yeah. <laughs> that young Bubba Gum Kush, <laughs> fucking Swisher Sweet. Uh, uh, what else? Go, go. You, you go, know Michael, it, Michael. Michael. Let's go, Michael. Spit the flow. He's a jukebox. Give him a, give him a quarter. Ding. I gotta pee. That's not the song. What are you doing, dude? Uh, my camera's gonna die. I need to plug it in. <gasps> plug it in? Every time. Dude, like last time when you were like, all right, bye. And then it just turned off immediately because they killed you. <laughs> that, was, that was a great bit. Mm-hmm. Let's, let's, all, let's all go back to that one for a second. Uh, I'm not gonna overlay it. We're just playing it in our heads. <laughs> uh, Cal was here. Freedom of speech and a nutsack. Fuck. Well, ah. Uh, well, you did it again. See? This has been brought to you by. Just put like one of those old timey like uh, movie theater <laughs> popcorn like intermission like breaks. Nice yeah. Like, Let's all go to the lobby. Let's all go to the lobby to get ourselves a drink. Dude, you know Prime Video has like a. Uh, like that as like a TV show where it's just like all the old uh, like intermission clips. I was watching that the other day. That sh- that shit was was fucking funny. Oh fuck. Um. Well, I think our our discourse has gotten as far as it's going to get to with these last five minutes. Uh, Walter's minute. What you got, Walter? What's what's your updates? Uh, um. Yeah, subscribe to Let's Watch This Podcast. On, no, uh, no, WFC. don't, no. don't do it. No, he's not allowed. No, don't do it. No, no, don't do it. We do movie breakdowns and um, review like. I'm cutting stuff. this out. Sorry. Give me a real Walters minute. Are you sponsoring your other shit, dude? <laughs> <laughs> You're not Michael's allowed. about to go kick your ass. <laughs> it's, it's it's like Edward when Edward's like my other friends. Edward, you don't have other friends, okay? We're your only friends. You're only allowed to have us as friends. <laughs> only friends. Walter, you're not allowed to have another podcast. You're only allowed to have us. That's it. No one else. No. Give us a real Walters minute. You need some diversity. I need some white friends, some black friends, some Mexicans. You know. We, we are Mexicans. We're, you're you're Salvadorian. Yeah. You're half Salvadorian, half when Mexican. I need a port. When I need a porch build, I'm going to call you guys. <laughs> okay, okay. I mean, I'm going to be supervising, i.e. not doing anything. That's a supervisor. I don't know about you. I'm, I'm going to be sleeping. <laughs> yeah. actually, port building time actually, is too early. We're going to send you to voicemail. <laughs> That's what's going to happen, realistically. You're going to call us. We'll send you to voicemail. Por- porch building time is, uh, I think, like that's like 8 a.m. I don't wake up till 10. Porch building time is like 4 a.m., dude. You uh, swing by 4 a.m. by the Home Depot. You yeah. pick up a gaggle of Mexicans. You put them in the back of your truck. They build your house. It's like the Amish, dude, except you pay them. Mm. And uh, that they won't freak out when you have a button. Thank you, sir. Yeah, nice. And that's broke to oh, a yeah, my, my, uh, Wait, no, no, my what? My friend was going was to join us, but... He's kind of, he has like, he has like <coughs> low key Michael syndrome. He's like, oh, I wake up like at four type shit. He doesn't sound like Michael syndrome. <laughs> Stop like, wasting my paper my towels room, before like, I kill you. So I'm like, all right, whatever. Well, we're going to record an episode after this. Weren't you going to bring a oh, guest? Okay. Yeah. yeah. Stop wasting them. I'm going to charge you 25 cents. Yeah, take it home. Take it home. <laughs> <laughs> he takes the whole roll. Yeah, okay, that's, that's real tough Friday. Once, once Michael starts handing me paper towels, that's how we know it's the end of it. Thank you guys for watching. for checking off. I'm about to go to the spa. (laughs) I'm going to the spa. We're broke till Friday. Goodbye, my friends. We'll see you next week. Now I'm going to go and eat my meat. And we're broke till Friday Bye my friends We'll see you next week And now I'ma go And beat my meat And we're broke Till Friday